There are foreign stars and Korean celebrities who differ in nationalities, but who are always compared online for their many similarities. You can check out the comparisons and conflicting qualities of celebrities of two different countries on Showbiz Korea Stars Big Match. Let's find out who today's stars are. This week we have the sexy actress, Scarlett Johansson, and Korea's top actress, Ha Ji Won. Let's check out the two's kaleidoscopic qualities right this minute. First off, let's check out the two's acting ability. Would you forget about Scarlett Johansson began game? acting when she was young through the play Sophie's away. Story. Soon she made her acting debut through the movie North at the age of 10. She continued to play supporting roles in many movies. When she was 14, she starred in Home Alone 3 and slowly built up her filmography. Her true value stood out in the movie Ghost World. Johansson acted as a rebellious and lethargic teenager. It was well received by film critics and she became a young actress with a lot of potential. Soon Johansson became an adult actress through the movie Lost in Translation. Her acting was recognized when she received the Best Actress Award at the Venice International Film Festival. She does all sorts of genres, characters, and broadened out her acting spectrum through many different productions. She starred in science fiction as well as period pieces and traditional mellow productions. Let's now check out her qualities. No stranger to action, she did Iron Man 2 and The Avengers. She became an attractive femme fatale in the movie's Match Point and Vicky Cristina Barcelona. She showed her qualities through her passionate acting. Let's now meet actress Haji Won. She debuted through the drama Adults Don't Know. Soon she began to be in the spotlight as she acted as a rebellious student in the 1999 drama School 2. Her silver screen debut production was Truth Game. She received the Newcomer Award in 2000 at the Taejong Film Awards. And thus she became a rising actress in the film industry. Soon she starred in horror movies, Nightmare, and Phone. Her eyes were filled with madness in the two films and earned her the nickname Horror Queen. Aside from horror genres, Haji Won starred in many productions of different genres on both the big and the small screens. The productions were very popular as she showed a new side of herself every time. She became a top star, so let's now check out her hit productions. With the sexy image in the movie Sex Zero, it became a huge hit for her. Soon she showed action and mellow acting in the drama Tamil and received the Top Excellence Award at an award ceremony later on. Her drama What Happened in Bali secured high viewer ratings and gave her another Top Excellence Award. Hajiwan became an actress who's known for her outstanding acting skills and for creating hit productions. She showed off her voluptuous charm through the 2006 drama, Huang Jini. This drama presented the actress with the grand prize at an awards ceremony. Soon thereafter, she became an actress who draws over 10 million viewers to theaters through her 2009 movie, Heyunday. She continued to challenge herself. Ha Ji Won acted as a strong stunt woman in the 2010 hit drama, Secret Garden, and created the Ha Ji Won Syndrome also known as the Kill Lime Syndrome. She showed charismatic acting in the drama Empress Ki and received the grand prize once again. Hajiwan is showing sweet romantic acting these days in the drama The Time We Were Not In Love. Let's see if Hajiwan will work her magic so that the drama will be a huge hit. Next up, let's check out the two's action acting. Scarlett Johansson is considered one of Hollywood's modern sex symbols with her voluptuous figure. She revealed her figure in a latex outfit in the movie Iron Man 2 and showed jaw-dropping action scenes. She bewitched the viewers with her sexy movements and charisma through her role as Black Widow. Johansson played Black Widow again in the movie The Avengers and showed amazing scenes in action once again. She underwent a strenuous routine to play the role to perfection. First off, she needed to lose weight to wear the ultra-small costume of Black Widow. She wore the costume only after losing weight by eating grilled cheese sandwiches every day. Thanks to her diet, you could see a sexy Black Widow with a perfect figure. She received intense martial arts training to portray Black Widow to perfection. She learned Kung Fu, Wushu, and other martial arts and learned to handle weapons as well. Superb action scenes were made thanks to her hard work and passion for action acting. 
In the movie Lucy, Scarlett Johansson was the leading lady for the first time in her career. She showed her distinct action acting in this movie. She became one with her role as Lucy, laden with action and emotion. She worked with Korea's top star, Choi Min Shik, in this movie, and it received mainly positive reviews. Johansson is a sexy Hollywood actress, and she keeps challenging herself to action acting. Make sure you check out her future action acting as well. I think it makes the audience. Ha Ji Won is one of South Korea's most sought after actresses and is known for her versatility in pulling off action scenes. One perfect example is in the drama Tamo and the movie Duelist. Let's check out her activities in the action genre. She became a female boxer in the movie Miracle on First Street. She trained for three months with bruises and even a crooked nose. Afterwards, she trained like an actual boxer without using a stunt double, living up to her reputation as an action queen. Hajiwon obtained licenses in scuba diving and riding motorcycles for her action scenes in the movie Sector 7. Her action scenes are intense and charismatic, and her hard work does pay off and shows. Last but not least, let's take a look at the two's infinite qualities. Aside from acting, Scarlett Johansson was interested in singing and music. She tried her hand at singing in the movie Lost in Translation. Many probably remember that particular scene from the movie. Finally, in 2008, she released her debut album, Anywhere I Lay My Head, and made her official debut as a singer. Good and bad views were mixed about the album, and mostly, it was a flop. Soon later, she participated in the soundtrack of the movie, He's Just Not That Into You, and did various other activities as well. She succeeded as an actress and a singer, and her final goal was to be a director. Be sure to keep rooting on for her in her future endeavors. Get off your desk, sit in your chair. Now shifting our focus back to Hajiwon, she performed in the music video of singer Wax's song Oppa. Thus many were confused at first that Hajiwon was the singer Wax. Hajiwon couldn't hide her multiple talents though because later on in 2003, she was active for a while as a singer with the song Home Run, which is on the soundtrack of the movie Reversal for Fortune. In 2014, she released the song Now in This Place for her fans and gave a shot at writing for a reality TV program on cable. She also publicized the song You Are Zoe. Hajiwan delights her fans with her superb singing skills. She's multi-talented and we hope she continues to wow us. Scarlett Johansson and Hajiwan can act, they can do action scenes, and they're outstanding singers. We checked out the similarities and differences between the two. Showbiz Korea will continue to support the two in their future activities. Now, you are Showbiz Korea. Channel,